part of the process is to try to get physicians engaged in a lot of the um, a lot of the new processes that we're trying to implement, one of them being this new um, access to care, open access as some people call it, is um, having them um, meet with me per se, um, who already has open access, um, talking to them about some of the challenges that I've had, um, trying to make them understand how it's been positive for me in regards to giving my patients access to health care. I've also have worked with the hospital to be able to give me an opportunity to have four physicians, leader physicians, work with me and compensate those providers for um, doing different projects um, with me, one of them being access to health care. There's one provider in, in particular who's probably the busiest doctor at our centers by far, and he was one of the leaders um, that worked with me one-on-one -on -one to try to um, engage other providers to um, participate in this process of open access. It's hard to argue with someone who's the busiest doctor in the centers to say, well, I'm too busy, I don't want to do this, or I can't do it because I see too many patients. When this individual who's really pushing for it is the busiest doctor, there's no argument. That doesn't fly. So it, it allows people to see, hey, if this doctor can do it, there's no reason why I can't do it. And so I've been trying to engage doctors like him to kind of help me to kind of get the word out and motivate other providers to um, participate in this process.